Okay, so I'm a bit late to the party, but it's time to get into Remind, the DLC we've all been waiting for. Now one thing is, I do like how they got this new title screen, both the Remind and also Kyrie with Sora. I never noticed how short her skirt was, it's impossible not to notice in that picture, I don't know. Is it just me or is it never that short? I don't know, I'm not usually looking there. In any case, um, another thing that got updated was some cutscenes got like a little bit of an HD retouch or like some new effects got added in, but um, a YouTuber by the name of Everglow has a, a video basically kind of comparing and contrasting, so I'm, you can just look that up. I'm not going to go through all the cutscenes like that. Uh, and that's pretty much it. Uh, just can now get started. Now the way Remind works is I have to import a save, and the difficulty and level you know, that you're of Sora, depends on the file. Now, I wanted to have Oathkeeper and Oblivion, so I, and to get Oathkeeper, I'm sure everyone already knows, but in case anyone doesn't, to get Oathkeeper, you have to get all 99 uh, Lucky Emblems, and Oathkeeper, you have to beat the game on Critical. So I did the, I got the Oathkeeper, you know, in the first file, so I had to make a second file to get Oblivion, and I admit, I use the easy pass to be critical, which does get you oblivion, so if you don't want to play critical normally, or, or you're just too bad at it, like me, uh, you can just do that. Although, I did make it to the Keyblade Graveyard on critical normally, but I decided, like, wait a minute, let's try easy pass, and it worked. So then, this is the file where I kind of, like, just went through the whole game real quick, skipped all the cutscenes, you know, and, you know, leveled up to 99. I have Oathkeeper and Oblivion from here. I really want, I haven't used them. I have forged them to the highest level, but I have not used them. So, yeah, of course, I, I, I did get a little bit spoiled on some things, like who the big super duper secret boss is, though I'm sure most people could probably have figured it out on their own. But uh, in terms of like, of, like, the story and any kind of new lore we get, I'm blind to this. I, I do know also a, a couple other small things, but nothing about, like, the lore story. But uh, one thing is that uh, Master Xehanort has a new voice actor. I'll, I'll get into him in a bit. May your heart be your guiding key. Well, we've seen this already. But it did get cut off. I do remember that. Huh? A black goat stashes away a letter, then orders a white goat to search for it. Why do you have to bring race into this? Intentions possibly be. Hey, Luxor. Yeah, it did kind of hint that Luxor was going to be kind of important in the trailers. I remember that. Yeah, a anything from the trailers, I'm gonna consider not a spoiler. Like that, Uzora is a part of this. Perhaps he forgot where it's hidden. Yeah, I'm still wondering what Luxor's card that he gave Sora what that is. Or the mm. has truly gone missing. Fuck off, Luxor. <laughs> no one likes you. You're the boring organization member. See, even Zabar's like, this is. <laughs> he's well, he's tired of this shit. Now please shut the fuck up. <laughs> yes. I kind of what what are on his card? I guess they're double sided. I was just about to ask what are on his cards. However, oh. I sometimes can't help but read into my opponent's strategy. I do. Yeah, I do remember he had he has a uh, voiced like his displeasure about being so low and not knowing what the higher ups are up to in past games. So this actually is in character. What little he has. Was it Xehanort or Xemnas who gave the order? Uh, yes. <laughs> yes, the, the, yeah. It's the same thing, really. <laughs> All Xehanort cares about is the clash between the seven lights and thirteen darknesses. Have you noticed his voice has changed lately? It's kind of weird. such an interest in this mysterious box. Which means the order was issued by Xemnas. Well, that makes sense, yeah. Yeah, Master Xehanort never mentioned the box at any point, so... That, that does make sense, actually. That's not, not something I ever really thought of. Oh man, you talked to that guy? He's such a bore. And neither does Namora. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> Aren't you curious? I heard it contains information that's vital to all Keyblade wielders. Secrets. Well, what kind of secrets? That's hear? very vague. That can mean anything. Hmm. I don't remember. 
I keep my eyes and ears wide open, but I've traveled so many different places. It's hard to keep everything straight, you know? Hmm. Oh, Zig. Yeah, I'm gonna call him Zigbar, even though we know his true identity. I'm just so used to calling him that. If this box is truly as important as I, I don't know if I'll ever be able to be used to calling him Lushu. I believe you discovered that others also seek it. And you need to find it before anyone else does. I, I just want Pete and Maleficent to just stumble upon this conversation. Just like, what the hell are you two doing up here? What's going on? Did I hear something about box? Got my car back. No matter. It doesn't make a difference to me. It's all the same. No, no seriously, I need that car back. It's a blue eyes white drag, it's pretty rare. That, he threw away his car. What the hell? That's rude. The question is who are you? Luxord. I always thought I always pronounced it Luxord. I I I don't remember ever it ever being pronounced Luxord. I don't know. I, I I guess I, I don't remember it ever being pronounced that way. I'm not sure why I thought it was Luxord. <laughs> so what are we looking at? It's finally over. Oh yeah. Hey. Yeah, but Kyrie's fucking dead. Oh. Anyone else remember that? That was just fucked up shit. <laughs> remember when Mazur Zaynor slaughtered a teenager and then ten minutes later went to heaven? Yeah. Remember that? That was some fucked up shit. I know what to do. Sora. My whole journey began the day I lost her. And every time I find her, she slips away again. Not after Kingdom Hearts 2. She, she was fine for a while after that. Out there, alone. Dead, screaming, probably in horrible pain. <laughs> probably in torture and in hell somewhere, who knows. She's in hell. We did horrible stuff between games. Horrible, raunchy stuff. The kind of stuff that did, did one-way ticket to hell. That sort of stuff. That's why she's not a princess of heart anymore. Or it, I, actually, I don't remember. Is she? I actually don't remember. Yeah, we've seen this. Didn't we? I'm pretty sure we've seen this exact cutscene. I'm pretty sure. Let him go, Mickey. We we're better off without him. He's an idiot. His heart and his mind are made up. Yeah, they're so mean to Sora. They're always just like, yeah, he's useless. He can't do anything right. It's like, what the fuck? He saved the universe like three times. Come on, he deserves a little bit more respect than that. Now, how do I start? Oh fuck! He, God, you broke a whole reality again, Sora. Come on, you can't do that. For fuck's sake! Now God's gonna come down and fix that. I mean, Jesus Christ! All right. <laughs> yeah, so I'm not really sure like what this. Tr I know there's a bunch of bonus bosses. I know that, but I'm not really sure like when those when that happens. I that's I'm not really sure. I'm a little bit vague on those details. Uh, hello. Who the heck? Uh, yeah, I can't see any traits of his face, so. Hmm. Okay, can't see any traits of that face either. I was gonna say the master of masters because we never saw his face, but. Or this could be in the past, maybe. So. Huh. Oh, oh. I thought that was yeah. Lushu. I thought that was Lushu. It oh, he's got silver eye. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is a flashback. And that's the Master of Masters. Who's still Ray Chase. I'm only mentioning that because he's also the, um, the, recently, he's the dub voice for Bruno Bruccerati, which I, I just wanted to mention because I'm a JoJo nerd. The reason for my existence. Oh, boy. <laughs> st 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 the world. I guess it makes sense for him to, for a Kingdom Hearts character to voice a guy, you know, whose stand power is zippers. Act. 
Now here's the Star of Darkness. Here we go. Darkness lurks in the pit of everyone's heart. Is he, is he gonna like close his eyes and they're gonna become golden when he opens them? God, it's such an emo. Sounds like your trip around the world opened your eyes, but which world? Got a little bit more than you anticipated. There's like 50 million worlds. How many? Which one are we talking about? Those who are weak and who desire greater power simply strip the strong of their power and convince themselves they've earned it. Uh. uh That's how people become tainted by darkness. What the hell is he talking about? They believe what they want to believe, using hollow reasons as justification. They repeat this cycle, and their darkness grows. <laughs> He's just like, eh, wrong answer. <laughs> Sorry, you're just an emo brat. <laughs> I love the Master of Masters. He's such a goof. It's better they be ruled by darkness. I thought he wanted the balance of light and darkness. Now we're talking about darkness being the more powerful one again. Make up your mind, Namora. Which is it? Pretending to be wolves. Though I admit, I can understand why. Oh, never heard that one before. A keyblade wielder willing to side with the darkness. But we have seen that before. Well, okay. Okay, yeah. I, uh, yeah, the Darklings were consumed by darkness. That's a little bit different. Does that really count as choosing? You know what? Never mind. There needs to be order. You sure about that? Hmm. Why not just sit back and watch it play out? Understanding hearts is difficult. More so the emotions within. I simply realize that it's easy to dismiss what you don't comprehend. Yeah, so I'm, I'm just kind of watching. Right. The world needs you. I'll grant you that one. Does it? Does it really? I know what I can do. Uh, are, are you sure about that, Master of Masters? What comes next is too important. I suppose letting false light dictate the future might be a pretty lousy move. But why? So, oh, no. Make a change. You have that power. What do you want for the world? But which world? There's many worlds. <laughs> I know. They mean like all the worlds at once, basically. My training's coming to an end, and the exam's not far off. I haven't studied at all. I'm so fucked. You're letting the exam decide. It's multiple choice. You know that, right? Don't matter. You believe the world needs you. That's all it is. Just A, B, C, D. There's no. There's not much thinking involved. It's funny. Somehow. Oh, yeah. I can sense where I'm supposed to yeah, yeah, he talked about this. Like, the future, his future fate is etched into his heart. That mumbo-jumbo. We, we've talked about this, yeah. Or he's talked about this. There's something familiar about it. Uh-huh. if I'm meant to wear this. Hmm. No. <laughs> you'll ditch it soon. Yeah, you'll wear, like, a skirt. It's pretty weird looking. I mean, that one day you're going to outgrow it. Quite literally, oh, so. <laughs> you'll get taller. Possess great power. The darkness can't control you. You'll wear a skirt and well, really tight gloves. Coat to stay safe. In fact, you'll be the one controlling the darkness instead. Me, on the other hand, I'm too much of a scaredy cat to ever <laughs> take mine off. <laughs> Who are you really? Oh, fucking hell! So I love Master of Masters. Color. <laughs> I do end up a scanny cat. Well, I could lie and tell you that's what I am when I'm actually a brilliant artist or even a scholar. I just, could tell you that I dream of world peace. Just give us a fucking answer. I'm actually planning for its destruction. The truth is what you see with your eyes, oh, not what you hear. Fuck off. Just give us an answer. Something, a name, anything. So, your name? Eh? Uh? <laughs> Never mind. Oh, no we're not gonna hear it, are we? My name is fucking hell. I knew it. God damn it, I knew it. Fuck. <laughs> you can't keep teasing us like this, Nabora. You can't keep getting away with it. What he? Lost master. Huh? What? What the fuck? A lost master. Lost master. 
What the fuck does that mean? That's never been a thing. Has it? I don't remember anything about a lost master. Fucking hell. Be your guiding key. Stop pushing that. <laughs> what is it? It's Sor. His name's Sor, isn't it? I, I have seen people theorize that Sor is indeed... 75 years later. Here, just a little time skip. Uh, I've seen people uh, theorize that uh, Sora is the master of masters. I don't know how much I buy into that, but it really wouldn't surprise me. Okay, okay, I'm just gonna hear him talk. But so funny, old man. Mind sharing with us? I, I just want to hear, you know, Christopher, uh, Christopher Lloyd, the new master of Xehanort's voice. Speak up. I stand here today because of a fated encounter. Very many years ago, when I was still a young lad, I never learned who he was, and perhaps I never will. But I see now the truth he spoke of. Huh. Huh, I like I it. I mean, I, I've, I've always liked Christopher Lloyd, you know, his voice and his acting, so that's not really, you know, so it's, you know, whatever. Only three of us are here right now. Yeah, where the fuck is everybody? Are you absolutely sure the others? But yeah, um, yeah, I'll just go over. You know, for anyone who doesn't know, somehow Christopher Lloyd is Doc Brown for Back to the Future. I don't usually go over live action stuff, but he's also like Judge Doom from Who Framed Roger Rabbit and Uncle Fucking Fester from The Adams Family. Well, there's Uncle Fucking Fester. Uh, in terms of voice roles, he's Doc Brown in a couple things, like a Lego game. Uh, he's the page master from the page master. He's uh, he's Murloc from the DuckTales uh, Treasure of the Lost Lamp movie. Um, he's Rasputin from the Anastasia. He's uh, Mr. Clipboard from Food Fight. And he's the woodsman from um, Over the Garden Wall. But yeah, I, I, I'm so far, I like him more than the previous voice actor, whose name I can't even remember. The, the guy who died, not Leonard Nimoy. Well, the, Leonard Nimoy died too, but you know. The second English voice actor. So far, I like Christopher Lloyd better than him. I can't remember his name because I'm stupid. Stop smirking, old man. All right. The hearts of Ansem, Zemnus, Benitas, Riku Replica, and Xehanort. <laughs> Riku Replica. Where they came from and reassembled once more. I, I just like how he calls him that. Each of them is seeking a guardian of light. So the ones who turn human and then back again into nobodies. Oh boy, here we go. Me, <laughs> it's you, gonna get confusing. Luxord, Marluxia, and Larxine. That's five. Oh boy. The ones from the past transferred into replicas. Are oh. Hansen, Zemnus, Venus, so they're replicas, huh? Replica, and the old man's <laughs> younger self. Huh. Wait, really? I didn't know that. What? The total comes up to 11. I think we're still missing two. Wait, so Zemnis and Xehanort's Heartless and Young, th those are all replicas? What? Why we have I don't remember that being a thing. My incarnations from past times, vessels into which I transferred my heart, my essence, were destroyed. Thus I was restored to what you see now. For one to completely disappear, mm. their heart and body must be restored to their original form. So I'm just listening to Lloyd talk a little bit more. Yeah, he's really good. I, well, I mean, I, again, I always liked Christopher Lloyd, you know, just in general, so. originated from terror, or rather his young form, and it too was restored. Uh, so they're both restored? Is that how it works? Or his is yet lost. Okay, I, I guess that makes sense. I decided to fill this yeah, the, this I, I am a little bit confused about this sort of thing, honestly. Some of this time travel stuff does kind of... Because the more makes it such a big clusterfuck, that's why it confuses me so much. Wasn't there some Mary Sue character that we had here? Uh, lying around we can use? were created by Vexen. The first 12 were nothing more than puppets. Barely human. Ooh. The prototype model was the Riku replica, and then number I was made. That leaves us with. Uh, I isn't a number. Just saying. Some Zemnus, 
Yeah, so those are all replicas, huh? Interesting. Young Xehanort's hearts. Five vessels. One left. Let's see. Jason and Demix are candidates. Yeah, but why? <laughs> why just backups? I don't understand that. Uh, is to give it a heart that is connected to Sora's. But why? Connected to Sora. Why him? He's not that important. Anyone in mind? Uh, the second prototype that was created. Number I. Can we not, please? <laughs> can, can we just, like, <laughs> erase from me- Oh, it remained in records? Whatever. I guess that makes sense. Yeah, I was about to say, if she was erased from the memories, how the fuck do you know about her? Number I. I's not number. <laughs> For a really shitty character. While young Xehanort is occupied with transferring hearts, I must go fulfill my duty. I will go and retrieve Vexen. Reliable as always. It sounds to me like you've got everything dependably under control. Well, I'm off to do my part. All right, bye bye, Zibar. See you later, buddy. God, those fucking wrinkles on Sather Zaynor's head. Ugh. Yeah, every time I see his, that bald fucking head of his, I keep staring at those big, gross veins. Ugh. Disgusting. But why do you need a vessel that's connected to Sora? May what is that? Be your guiding key. Shut the fuck up. That was never a thing. Shut up. God, I hate that. I hate it so much. Yeah, but why does one of the vessels need to be connected to Sora? What purpose does that serve? That didn't really seem to really matter much, you know, in the big clash. Eh, whatever. I want to say they'll give us an explanation, but uh, I'd be surprised. Boy, this seems familiar. This is. Oh, God, I'm in heaven. I died again. <laughs> <laughs> that fucking noise. Cheerothy. Hey. Back so soon? Yeah, I tripped, broke my neck, died. You know how it is. <laughs> I like how the music slowly faded away. That thing's got serious. <laughs> Don't groan at me. Even with the power of waking. You can't just bring someone back. Fucking watch me. Heart hasn't been lost yet. She's still with us, right? I, I I'm the main character. I'll do whatever I want. Damn it. I'm afraid the situation is a lot worse. Hey, I've already restored six hearts. What's one more? Yeah, he's got a point. But that's not how it's supposed to work at all. He's Sora. He just ignores the rules. <laughs> Sorry. That's just how it is. Not to restore them after they've completely faded away from existence. You've done that six times before. And as a result... God is pissed. <laughs> alter the course of history itself. But in a positive way, it's... A nature taboo. Bah. A nature... We have more time travel in Kingdom Hearts 2. Come on. It's fine. And you'll end up paying an extraordinary price. <gasps> yeah, we, we've already fucked about with time, though. What the hell? <laughs> Who cares? We've done that already. I've heard that before. Xehanort's done it. So Sora's done it with Merlin's help. You'll lose your powers. You won't be able to use the power of waking. Oh, and his also pow all his powers and stats for the next game, is that what we're getting into? Not all. You yourself will vanish from this world. Didn't you see the ending to Kingdom Hearts 3? You can't return to the world you came from. I don't care. <laughs> what? <laughs> There's a lot I don't understand. Like math and reading. I know that this is all I can do right now. I have to do everything I can to get Kyrie back. Aww. That's the whole reason behind my journey. <sighs> I can't stop you, can I? You can try. <laughs> try it. See what happens, furball. <laughs> I'll tear up, tear you up, and uh, rip out the stuffing. Well, then this really is goodbye. So listen carefully to me. Huh? What? 
Wait, I can't listen if you've... Okay. You'll return huh? to the past again. Oh, here we go. This is important. But you won't be able to rewrite it this time. Wait, what? No matter what happens, you have to accept it and move on. Huh. Uh, oh. Uh, okay, let's see. So, yeah, I got the ultimate weapon and then Oathkeeper Oblivion. Uh, yeah, uh, I, just, I should maybe put on some items, maybe some potions. Ether. Elixir. That sort of stuff. Um, yeah, I got all my abilities here. I, yeah, level 99, so I have every ability I, I can, or I feel like putting on, really. So. Got everything there I need. I'm, I'm all good. I'm ready to close the menu and, uh, you turn to action. I'm good. I'm all good in the neighborhood, trust me. Is everybody okay? Well, I didn't see any subtitles there. The heart you have there we go. It already existed during that time. I feel, this is gonna confuse the hell out of me. I'm just gonna warn you now. Nothing can change that fact. So is that why they just sort of just pretended like none of this happened? Is the tear in the fabric of time that was created when you changed your destiny, then changed it once again. In order to not stray too far from the true power of waking, you'll enter and pass through the hearts of the guardians uh, until you reach Kyrie's heart. What? What the hell does that mean? Every emotion that each of the guardians felt. Sadness. Anxiety. Horniness. Does that count as an emotion? Kindness. That's not an em kindness is not an emotion. And everything that they felt the ki kindness that's not an emotion, sorry. You'll clear away through it. Traverse across their hearts and dive ever deeper inside. What? I genuinely have no idea what the hell is going on. What? I can't be sure what's waiting for you at the end or what you'll actually be able to do. Uh, are we talking about what he like went through the Grim Reaper stuff? You'll come to discover a great well, no, that, that he didn't feel their emotions and stuff. No. Huh. But in this flow of time in the past, you'll only have up until the moment you left for this place. So you'll have to find and restore Kyrie's heart before then. What? That's all the advice I can give you. Like I'm not even. I'm not trying to be funny. I have no idea what the hell's going on. Going into the heart of. Shut up. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh, what? So he's gonna go into their hearts to experience what they experienced? I'm not really sure why or how. I don't I don't get it. Is Ven's heart. Like yeah, like no joke. I seriously really confused right now. So what uh, so he has to hop the hearts to, before he reaches Kyrie's heart. But why exactly? I did I miss it? Was there a reason for that? Was I not paying close enough attention? What? Ooh, that's all. I don't like. What is that? What? Who said that? Uh, well, he's too pure for this game. Just let him die. He's too. He's too good for this what? world. <laughs> what? The same darkness from uh, Union Cross, or? Oh, maybe. Oh. Oh, jeez. Uh, what? Uh. What? Um. What? Oh, what? Why? Why are you here? I already dealt with you. Um. Okay. I guess I'm finding this guy get Dark Inferno, whatever. Uh, uh, X. Oh no, I don't like this. Oh fuck. Yeah, here. All right, so here's a. Uh, oh, oh wait, this is Oblivion. Okay. Ah, no, jeez. I wasn't ready for this. Let's see what the shot lock is. Let's see it. Oh, here we go. Oh, very universy. Huh. Yeah, I'm not really sure how to. I, I know you can dual wield these two, but I don't know how. I, I might need to look into that. Cause I, I know that's a thing. That you can dual wield the Oath Keeper and Oblivion. I've heard about that. Yeah, I tried to I tried to avoid spoilers, but you know, there's some things I just couldn't help but yeah, accidentally see. And you know, that was one thing. Oh fuck. 
Ah. Come on, come here, you. Ah, ah dark form. Oh, oh what? It's not, it's not that dark. All right, let's see what this is about. Right. Oh, oh, I didn't. Oh. I, I didn't get to show it off all the way. Darn it. I might need to go and like battle generic enemies if all the bosses here are gonna be that easy. Well, he was the first boss, so I am. I mean, I am level 99. I don't know. I did hear that like like some of the super bosses are really fucking hard, so. Uh. Uh, way to go, Sora. You got this. Or, no, you don't. So, uh, am I gonna get to a save spot anytime soon, or how's this gonna work? Because I, you know, I, I, you know, I only have so much time. I can't do this for like an hour and a half, and I don't want to make a video that long. Uh, well, so is he gonna enter her heart or Goofy's heart, maybe? Or was it only the Guardians of Light? Goofy and Donald. Oh, here we go. I love this. This was the best shit ever. It's still. <laughs> oh shit! He's fucking dead! I don't care what anyone says. Ter Terranor just fucking died there. I, I don't care what anyone, not even Nomura says. He just got fucking disintegrated. Anyone, even the more, even if the more himself says otherwise, I don't care. He got disintegrated. Terranor just motherfucking died. Um, oh, Aww. <laughs> poor Donald. He looks so sad. Donald dead. Then, Van, wake up. Van, you sleepy bum. Uh, oh, there we go, Aqua. Aqua's turn. Is this Aqua's heart? D gee, I wonder. Ven's heart was so peaceful. Um. But this. Oh. This is fear. I was about to say it looks pretty much the same, just you know, different stained glass design. This can't be real. It can be. Huh? Oh yeah, there's a wait a minute. No, wait. No, no, never mind. I was thinking something else. I was thinking when Riku replica appeared and then he got a stand. You know, just a big shadowy figure of Master Xehanort appeared for no reason. That was really weird. Oh, pull it together, Sora. Don't be such a pussy. We haven't lost them. They still have their hearts. But what about their other internal organs? Are they okay? How about their bones? Are they okay? Their brains? I mean, Axel hit that rock pretty hard. His brain might have, might have got jostled a bit. Might have a concussion. We stand together. Let's go. Yeah, and this ended so well. Goofy. Watch the others. Goofy. I can't. I can't take it seriously, no matter how ser like how, like no matter how serious the person is when they say goofy, it, it's always silly to me. Yeah, here we go. Fucking demon type. It's such bullshit. They're just a bunch of shadows. Why are they so powerful? It's bullshit. Yeah, then, yeah, the fucking heartless tornado. This was some of the dumbest stuff, but I actually kind of love it too. It's so stupid that I love it immensely. I, I like the ones that are on the outside. They're just kind of tumbling through the air. Like, oh god, get me down from here. I don't want to be a part of this. <laughs> it can't be. No. It's a tornado. This is even dumber than Sharknado. Well, maybe not. What? Uh. What the fuck? Okay, yeah, that would actually kind of terrify me too, honestly. I wonder if she gave up. I would too if I had to see that. Christ, that's horrifying. Yeah, I don't again. I don't blame her. I'd be scared shitless too if I saw that. So, this is the fear and despair that Aqua feels. And now, I feel it too. Aw. His empathy is too powerful. 
that, that is horrifying, actually. If if I saw a bunch of me's in a giant tornado like that, I would be I would shit my pants. Yeah, I, I would just embrace death too. Honestly, that would just, like ruin my life. So now I'm gonna have to fight evil Aqua, right? Is that what we're doing? Yeah, I'm not sure why with Ven it was Dark Inferno. That he doesn't really have any connections to Ven, but. At least, I don't think he's supposed to. I, I don't know what kind of connection. Anti-Aqua. I like Dark Aqua. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Alright, let's see how the uh, Oath Keeper is. Uh, uh, yeah, I know it's not finished, but I just wanted to... Oh, a bunch of little Keyblade games, Keyblades came out. Yeah, I know I didn't charge it up completely. I, I just didn't want her like to teleport away or anything. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Shit. No, no. Light form. Yeah. Yeah. So I I don't know is, if is it if I fill it up again, does that make the well shit? I'm too powerful. I can't be stopped. Maybe if I refill the bar again, maybe that's how I do a wield. I don't know. I I don't know. I I, I probably should have looked into that before I started this. I just saw that like I was looking up like okay how do I get oblivion? Is it really critical mode? And then I did see some with like yeah dual wieldings of things like oh okay that's kind of cool. But I don't think I was ever. I don't think I saw an explanation as to how to do it. I think that might have been like, or before the DLC dropped. I don't know how they knew that then. I don't know. Aw, <laughs> poor Sora. His girlfriend just fucking died. <laughs> All right. So who's next? Riku. Right. Um. What? Uh. Ven. Sarah, we found you. Y yeah, we s we saw all this already. What? Okay. what we Please say you're in there. What gives, Aqua? I know that you're not him. What? Now let our friend go. Is this Terra's heart? Oh no, it's yours. Did I? Did I pass through the tear? I'm still only kind of vaguely aware of what's going on right now. Hi, Nomine. Sora? Fancy seeing you here. Nomine? What hey, what's you doing here? What are you doing here? It's my heart. You lost yourself like I did. Well, it's a long story. I don't even understand it myself. Tell me, why haven't you returned to Kyrie's heart yet? Yeah, what the hell? I like how his, his hair changing color made a sound effect. I like that. He is their 13th. Ooh. Today is the day you all lose. We've now, seen this. Before you even face the 13, every last one of you will be torn heart from body. But didn't they want them to face the 13? Wasn't that the entire fucking point? The keyblade will still be oh, never mind. forged. I don't remember all the stuff that happened. Leave me alone. <laughs> I'm still not able to. But I replayed through the game, but I just you know, I skipped all the uh Yeah, the lingering will. I skipped through all the cutscenes to make it go faster. So are we gonna get a lingering will fight? I really want that. Like seriously, sincerely I do. Oh, <laughs> Anger. Lament. His lingering will, as it were. Thoughts? We're not gonna lose to you. Yeah, I remember that the whole nominee reaching out to Terra thing. That got revealed in like a like in an orchestra thing or something, right? Something along those lines. That got revealed like I think before the game even got released release or or not not that she called him that she talked to him or something i don't quite remember but it was re it was revealed like some kind of orchestra event or something that was like japanese only so good luck knowing about that got you xehanort still not xehanort but whatever close enough i guess Terra? nope lingering well this is impossible This moment. 
Did he talk during the original version? I honestly can't remember. I just kind of remember him just charging in and just blasting him with a laser. Wait, are we getting like an extended fight? I, I don't remember this. Did, did, did this happen? Is this new? I, I kind of remember him just coming in and blasting him with a laser. Ooh. I, I think, yeah, I don't think I saw this. Yeah, this is definitely something new, I think. Or, no, never mind. Yeah, then he just blasts him with the laser and he goes flying. Okay, never mind. Oh, fuck! Ah, it's like a fucking Dragon Ball Z shit. I love it. Huh? Yeah, yeah, then they just, like, kind of just go off somewhere else. Yeah, now, yeah, 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 yeah. That was. I don't know. I guess it was so long since I saw that cutscene. I wasn't 100% positive. Oh, wait, what? Oh, we're getting more. Okay, we are getting an extension. Oh, thank God. This is like, again, this is like some Dragon Ball Z shit right here. This especially. Good Christ. Oh, fire. This is so anime. Not that I'm complaining, necessarily. Come on. Keep fighting. Don't let that be the end. I need this. Wretched spirit. Lingering will. Close, though. As long as Master Xehanort resides within you, you're a threat to Aqua and Ven. How noble. You would give your life for theirs. Oh. You must be <laughs> this is so good. At all costs. Yeah, fight, 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 fight. Come on. Keep, keep fighting. Do, do something. Yeah, here we go. All right. Uh, damn it! No, don't cut away. Nominee. I wanted to see that. No, nah, whatever. No, his rage is too strong. He won't respond to me. He's being a pissy no little boy. Sure, it's bad for Terra. Either way, you have to leave. Go to the world of ocean and sky. That's not what it's called. You? I got this. <laughs> oh, okay, fair enough. I believe you. So he's gonna do Terra's heart, is that what we're doing? Oh boy. Come Guardian. Oh no. Leave him alone. Give fucking uh, uh, damage soul. Stand, oh no. Is he gonna die? Oh. Yeah, th what the hell? Like, Lingering Will was so fucking powerful. No way he would lose a him. Or he shouldn't. Ooh. Interesting. But he wasn't supposed to be inter- Yeah, he wasn't supposed to interfere directly, was he? I can travel to different times too, you know. He just said that so casually. I thought he wasn't supposed to be able to interfere like this. Or am I not- Maybe I wasn't remembering right, or a misunderstanding rather. Again, I'm I'm not even kidding. I am a little bit shaky on exactly what's going on. Uh. Yeah, Blinkering will help me. Yeah, I know I kicked your ass in Kingdom Hearts too, but you know. Oh, there we go. Oh fuck! Shit. Um. Oh. Uh. I was not expecting that. That, huh? I I was Seeing not. I that you huh? You have also taken the forbidden path. You too must be ready to make the ultimate sacrifice. Uh, anything but my bottle cap collection. Anything but that. Oh, here we go. Boss fight. I'm gonna shove the oath keeper right up your ass. Up oh, over here. Up oh, fuck. He's too weak to do anything. I'm too high of a level. <laughs> oh, 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 fuck. Yeah, uh, come on. I'm gonna. Uh, uh, I thought this said last form for a second. I'm like, wait, what did I do differently? Uh, I'm hoping I can fill the bar before he dies. Ah, <laughs> uh, fuck. Ah, uh, come on, hurry, fill, fill, fill. Here we go. Double form. Here we go. Dual wielding. Here we go. Yeah! Sorry, I got excited. I, I wanted to show this. I w yeah, I just wanted to see that before I killed him by accident. That was pretty cool. Oof. 
Damn. Sorry, I'm sorry. I got a little excited there. Dual wielding keyblades is always cool to me. Now we just gotta have like a fucking tri wielding keyblade thing, like Roro no Zoro. Um. Okay. You got some in your keyblade there, Sora, or no? <laughs> what the fuck? Why did you have your keyblade gone, dumbass? Well, fuck. Um, oh. <laughs> What's he doing? I love Richard Epcar. He's the best. You know, Richard Epcar is one of my favorite voice actors. But I'll be honest, I kind of wish Billy Zane got to you know stay as Master or Zane or Heartless. A new thing I learned is apparently this is like from a secondhand source, but apparently like a fan went to like some con and Billy Zane was there and he asked him, "Oh hey, look, ooh, a safe spot." Okay, actually I'm gonna end the video here because you know it's already been about you know 45 minutes, but um, uh, you know apparently Billy Zane just wasn't asked back, like it wasn't like a price thing or he refused. But again, this is like from like a post on Reddit about a guy who asked Billy Zane, you know, so I, you know, take that with a grain of salt. I know I am, but, you know, so far I'm g kind of confused as to what's going on with the time travel thing. It's still kind of, you know, I'm still a little bit shaky on it, but I, I think I kind of get it. But either way, it's been fun so far, even though I, I'm, I'm too powerful. <laughs> I mean, I know I'm a beginner, but still, Jesus Christ. Even I don't think even the bosses went down this fast. Yeah, you know, like in the regular mode, I don't think they went down this quickly. Jesus. But yeah, so this was, you know, it's been pretty f cool so far. Seeing more more organization shenanigans and stuff. Yeah, you know, like with, you know, Master Zaynord, Zigbar, Syax. I don't know why they had to go through this big explanation as to why they picked Shion, but whatever. That was a little bit weird. Yeah, you know, Luxord is kind of, you know... He's kind of figuring shit out, and Zabar seems to be kind of wary of him, but, yeah. Cool stuff, though. Um, yeah, so I'm, I'm going to call it a video here, because, you know, 45 minutes, or, or more than that, I've been rambling for a couple of minutes now. But yeah, so far, pretty fun. I'm, I'm I don't know how long this is. That's sort of a problem. I, I don't know. I don't know if this is going to be, like, a two or three video thing, or, like, a ten video thing. I have no idea. So I'll just kind of have to see as I go along. Glad I got the save point, though, because I, I was starting to worry about video length, and, you know, I, I got other stuff to do. I can't just be commentating for, like, two hours, you know. Um, but, yeah, so that's it for now. Next time, more Remind. I, I, I'm not really... I, I, wait a minute. Wait. Let's see. I, uh, I see you. I see you, Xehanort Heartless, and somebody else. I, I can't tell who that is. Wait, is that... Wait, who is that? I can't tell who that is. Ah, whatever. I'll see you in the next video. Anyway, so see you next time for more Remind and time shenanigans and heart fuckery and all that good stuff that we can expect from Game of Hearts. So I'll see you then. Bye-bye.